Hi everyone, so today I thought that I would do a review, well, not so much a review, but an um, initial reaction of the Glossy Box for January. Um, so, it came in the usual box, and then inside, as I'm sure you've all already seen, but it is pink. I'm absolutely going through a hot pink phase at the moment, so I will definitely make use of this box. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, and then inside, it comes well presented like this with a bow and a um, little heart. Very cute. And then inside, I will show you. Is looking like this. So what I will do is I will read from the card. On the front of this card it says Happy Valentine's Day from Glossy Box. So it's a Valentine's Day Glossy Box. And then inside it lists all the products. So I will go through them with you. Um so the first thing that caught my eye was the Skin Perfecting Primer by Murad. And that is a 5ml sample. Just a little sample. I haven't opened this yet. It's a little pump. <laughs> it seems to be able to get anything out of it. Ah. I don't know if you can see that bit that I've spilled out. So it's not actually clear. Huh. So that's different. I'll have to give that a try tomorrow. Um, and see how that goes. Now I first heard about Murad like a few years back when I'm on my <laughs> forever quest for um, mattifying my oily skin. And they had a... They had a... I've actually got it right here. I know this is going sidetracking but... Um, the oil control mattifier. This is what I actually went to Morad for. I barely use this, I don't think it's that great. But um so I've kind of had I was excited about Morad and then when I've tried their stuff, I've tried quite a few things and I haven't thought anything of them really. So I always hear a kind of hype about them and everyone seems to like their products. So you know it's good to get a free sample and I can give it a go. Um, and I'll read out what it says. Murad Hybrid Skin Perfecting Primer Dewy Finish. Oil free primer ignites a radiant glow powered by light enhancing minerals. Hmm. I don't know if that would be so great for me because I've got so much oily skin anyway. I don't know if I want a dewy finish. Well, I do. I mean, I'd love to have a dewy finish, but um, it says that it has power, light enhancing minerals. I don't know if I need anything reflecting off my face when I've already got enough oil on it. But, you know, I'll give it a go. Um, at least it's oil free. So, you know, maybe it'll work. I don't know. Okay, next thing is... Nectar. Is it Nectar? No, Devine's. Cleansing Nectar. This is what it looks like. I don't know what it's like, a kind of oily, liquidy texture. And this is Davies Cleansing Nectar, the authentic Davines formula for the beauty and delight of every woman. And it says it is a cleansing nectar hair body. Hmm. Hair and body oil shampoo. Okay, so I guess we can use this for the hair and body. When I first smell this, when I've just smelled this, it really reminds me of something, but I don't know what it reminds me of. Do you ever get that? Like, the smell hits you, and it brings, it's not even bringing me back a memory, but I just know that I've smelled it somewhere. Mm, but it's not the best of smells. It's very, it smells very clean. Mm, I prefer kind of like florally, scenty, coconut, pretty scents. But it, I mean, it's clean, so you know maybe that would be good to bring on holiday. You can use for your hair and body, you know. 
as with all these things, I'm always sure that I can make use of them because they're just small products. Right. The next thing is Davine's Moisturising Balm. Very nice packaging, I must say. It's kind of like a foily container, all kind of squidgy. And this, the authentic result of our commitment is a precious line of intelligent products rich in natural ingredients. And this is Authentic Moisturising Balm Face Hair Body. 98% natural derived ingredients with organic carthane oil. Hmm. So, this can be used face, hair and body. Okay. Let me have a look to see what kind of consistency this is. Kind of just kind of creamy. Mm, yeah, just like kind of. Don't really like the smell of it again. Oh my gosh, I'm just going to it everywhere now. Um, <laughs> all over me, it's just like spouting out the top. Um, it smells very similar to the to the other product. Was it from Davies? Yeah, it's just a very kind of clean smell. So no, I guess it's moisturising. I don't know if I'd want to put it in my hair though. Hmm. Maybe it's handy, you know, sometimes you haven't got serum with the only one, but they do say that you can put moisturiser on the ends of your hair. I, mean, I think I resorted to that once and it wasn't too bad, so I guess it's the same kind of principle. Um but it's got oils in it, so hmm. Okay, I must say, <laughs> I'm not overly excited by these products at all, like, I guess by getting these these glossy boxes, I should expect body products, but they do kind of bore me, because <laughs> the thing is, I have about a million face products and body products, but, you know, one day I might come across something that's amazing, and I always try and use them, and maybe some people out there will think, well, why sign up to the box if you're not going to be happy? But, you know, as I said, there, there might be stuff that I try and I think they're absolutely amazing. It's not like I'm going to not going to try them, but I couldn't say when I open a box that I get excited about them. Um, yeah. <laughs> That's all I have to say about those. And then next is the Ico Skinny Eyeliner. And what does it say about this? Get a handle on your eyeliner for precise definition and intense colour with a long lasting finish. So I have powder pink. Just when I when I first started, I thought, what am I gonna do? Pink? I'm not a big pink um eyeshadow eyeliner kind of person. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, it's coming out pretty much how it is. It's very uh like a creamy pink. Like it's not very pink at all. So I really don't think you'll be able to see it on my hand, but you can a little bit. See there. It's like a kind of lilac-y pale pastel pink, which I guess would be good for, um, maybe I could use it for highlighting or um, my bottom water line to wake my eyes up. You know, I, I think I could probably do more with it than what I first anticipated. So guess it's skinny so you got more precise application I guess I don't know I think I probably tend to still go hold it further down rather than up but you know there we go and then the last thing oh so it's a little heart sweet too which is cute but I'm on a diet so I can't make use of it mm. I think a lot of people got this for Valentine's Day and then the last product is Gentle body wash. Yay! <laughs> Another body product. Ooh. Okay. Um, what does it say about this? A moisturizing, irritant free, everyday cleanser, ideal for even the most sensitive skin. What did I just say? Was it body cleanser? No, it can't be. Uh, what is this? Used to cleanse, calm redness and relieve dry skin. Safe for sensitive skin. Oh, it is a body wash. What am I talking about? <laughs> I read body wash and I said body. 
and then I don't know. <laughs> then I thought that it was for my face for some reason, but it's a body cleanser. Hmm. What's the smell that? Again, this is just a really similar smell to that. Da How do you even pronounce it? To the Davines stuff. It's just a kind of clean. I guess. I guess they're not horrible. She will know. <laughs> but, um, like, I wouldn't be like, wow. Like, you know, as I said, I prefer, like, really sweet smelling things. But, you know, that's not for everyone. A lot of people might like the cleansing. I mean, it's not an offense to smell it, but, um, it's boring in my eyes. So, that was all my products. Um, I must say that compared to other boxes, um, I'm not entirely happy. Um, you know, I'll get to use all these products, but I don't think, I don't, none of them actually stand out to me where I buy them, like, wow, because, I mean, it's a kind of problem in a way when you see other people's boxes in the sense that um, Glossy Box does different products per person, because you, you see what people get and you're anticipating them, like I know this month a lot of people have got the Clarins, Clarins, sorry, um, was it Firmin lotions or something, now, I would have loved those. I would have loved to have tried those because they're two 15ml bowls and you kind of feel like it's worth your money. Um, and then as soon as I open the box and I see that I haven't got them, it makes me a bit disappointed. But, you know, it's the name of the game. You pay for these. Um, you know, one month you could get what you wanted. Last month I got what I wanted. Um, this month not so much. So, you know, half of me wishes that they would remain the same. Like everybody got the same product so that you wouldn't kind of feel a bit defeated or a bit like that's not the word jealous I guess that other people have got nicer products than you have or you know on the same when they might prefer your products so half of me wishes that everybody got the same but then I guess because a lot of people get their glossy boxes before other people it's not spoiling the surprise in that everybody gets different stuff so you still don't know what you're going to get like you know you might get something but of what you've seen but Oh my god, I'm babbling. <laughs> anyway, I don't know. I guess I'm never happy. <laughs> but, um, no, I mean, I'm not going to unsubscribe. Like, I'll keep going. Um, I'm, I'm with a Phil Unique box. I think I'm probably going to go to the Carmine box. Because I guess with, with three boxes on the go, I'm bound to find something that I like in a month. Um, but, you know, I do absolutely love the box. <laughs> Bonus. <laughs> but, um, yeah. I mean, and, and, you know, I guess the, the, I, the Ico... Um, line I'm sure I'll use you know as I said I'll use all of them but nothing just stands out like wow um, but the Clarins would have done but oh well as I said name of the game my choice to subscribe so if I don't get what I want oh well <laughs> anyway if you have any questions or you want um, any reviews on anything when I start to use them please let me know and um, yeah that's that so talk to you soon bye